Hi everyone! Welcome to Animals Channel, the place where you can learn everything about animals and their habits and personalities. Today I'm going to talk about some of the weirdest and wildest animals that live in the rainforest. The rainforest is a tropical ecosystem that covers about 60 of the Earth's surface, but contains more than half of the world's plant and animal species. The rainforest is also a hotspot for biodiversity, which means that there are many different kinds of living things that are unique and adapted to their environment. Some of these living things are so weird and wild that they seem like they belong to another world. They have features and abilities that are unlike anything else in nature. Animal number one. I, I, the eye is a type of lemur that lives in the rainforests of Madagascar. It is one of the most bizarre looking animals in the world. It has a long bushy tail, large ears, yellow eyes, and rodent like teeth. But what makes it really weird is its middle finger. The eye's middle finger is very long, thin, and flexible. It uses this finger to tap on tree branches and listen for hollow spaces where insects hide. Then it uses its finger to dig out the insects and eat them. The eye's finger is also used for grooming and communication. Animal number two. Mata Mata. The Matamata is a type of turtle that lives in the rivers and swamps of South America. It looks like a pile of leaves or mud on the bottom of the water. It has a flat, triangular head, a long neck covered with spines, and a brown or green shell with bumps and ridges. The Matamata's appearance helps it blend in with its surroundings and avoid predators. The Matamata is a carnivore that feeds on fish and other small animals. It does not chew its food, but sucks it into its mouth with a powerful suction. Animal number three, Saiga antelope. The Saiga antelope is a type of antelope that lives in the grasslands and deserts of Central Asia. It has a distinctive feature that makes it look very weird, its nose. The Saiga antelope's nose is large, bulbous, and flexible. It hangs down over its mouth and has nostrils that point downward. The Sega antelope's nose helps it survive in its harsh environment. It filters out dust and sand from the air, cools down the blood in hot weather, and warms up the air in cold weather. The Saiga antelope's nose also plays a role in mating. The males have larger noses than the females, which attract them during the breeding season. Animal number four, pink fairy armadillo. The pink fairy armadillo is a type of armadillo that lives in the dry grasslands and sandy plains of Argentina. It is the smallest armadillo in the world, measuring only about five inches long. It has a pink shell on its back, white fur on its belly, and tiny eyes and ears. But what makes it really weird is its tail. The pink fairy armadillo's tail is flat and wide at the base and narrow at the tip. It uses this tail as a shovel to dig burrows under the ground. The pink fairy armadillo's tail also helps it balance and steer when it runs. Animal number five, star-nosed mole the star. Nosed mole is a type of mole that lives in the wetlands and forests of North America. It has a dark furry body, short legs, and large claws. But what makes it really weird is its nose. The star-nosed mole's nose is a circle of 22 pink fleshy tentacles that surround its nostrils. It uses this nose as a sensory organ to detect prey and navigate in the dark. The star-nosed mole's nose is also very fast and precise. It can touch 12 objects per second and identify them in less than a millisecond. So, these are some of the weirdest and wildest animals that live in the rainforest. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new about these amazing creatures. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about these animals and if you have any stories or questions about them. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any of my future videos. I post new videos every week about animals and their habits and personalities. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. I hope you had fun watching it as much as I had fun making it. Stay tuned for more videos from Animals Channel. Until then, take care of yourself and the animals around you. Bye for now.